Hey, how's it going guys? Zach Cox here, and in today's Grand Theft Auto 5 video, we're going to be showing off how to knock over wind turbines in games. So, this is just a funny little glitch that you can do with your friends, or if you're trying to record funny moments, etc. It's something really, really cool that you can do, as well as you don't have to worry about being banned for doing this kind of glitch, because it's not game-breaking in any way, shape, or form. It's simply just a little glitch that can launch your car up in the air. It can send you flying up in the air, as well as you're just knocking over wind turbines, so it's what's not cool about that. Now, what you want to do to actually start this off is you're going to need a few items, and the first of which is sticky bombs. You're going to go ahead and need to acquire those, as well as have access to either a dump truck or just a heavy insurgent or just a major vehicle overall. The Liberator may even work. Now, a friend is optional for the sake of this video. Me and my good buddy Mr. Boss for the win actually did this. You guys can find his channel link down below in the description, but basically, once you have all of these items, what you need to do is head over to the windmill farm in GTA 5, of course. And once you're here, you need to go to a specific windmill or wind turbine. And that's one with yellow scaffolding just behind it, as well as a ladder leading up to the top. Now, the reason it's cool to have a friend with you is because, say, you're the one throwing the sticky bombs. On your screen, what you need to do is actually throw the sticky bombs on the base of this windmill. And on your buddy screen, the windmill is actually going to glitch and levitate just out of the ground and be just hanging there. So you may or may not see this on your screen if you throw the sticky bombs. As well as, once you throw those sticky bombs and you have confirmation that this thing is out of the ground on your friend screen, go ahead and have your friend climb up to the top of the wind turbine. And this is where you want to get in the heavy insurgent or the dump truck. Now, once your friend is on top, you just get in this dump truck or the heavy insurgent and just ram the base of the windmill. And all of a sudden, it's going to actually just start tipping over. And your friend is probably going to see it before you do because for some reason, that's the way the game works. And like even with the sticky bombs, when you throw them, you don't see the base come out of the ground, but your friend does. So it's going to start falling and then you will start to see it fall after you ram the base of this a couple times. And the propellers may hit you on the way down as well as it'll launch your car. It did that to me in the dump truck. It just sent that thing flying as well as it would just send me flying down a hill too. You can mess around with this thing. It's interactive. It's basically just like knocking over a giant... Uh, street light so it's not gonna despawn unless you leave the area so it's interactive up until you completely leave the area then it's gonna disappear of course but this is just a funny little glitch that you can do in game with your friends like I mentioned before whether you're trying to record funny moments or anything like that it's just a cool way to have a good time in GTA online so if you guys did enjoy the video of course definitely be sure to leave a like rating down below as well as don't forget to subscribe for some more daily Grand Theft Auto 5 content on my channel and with that said and out of the way, I believe that's just about it. You guys, I'll take it easy, have a safe one, and I will see you all in the next video.